remember when Savannah was empty? Those Crawford bastards did one thing right, I guess. There must be thousands of them. They didn't follow us here, did they? It sure seems like it. That's crazy. They can't track. They just roam. Is it? That fucking train wasn't exactly discreet. Clementine's out there somewhere. Gobbled up in all of that. We'll get to her, Lee. We'll do whatever we have to. Look, let's get our bearings and see if we can figure out a way to make it across town. Good? Good. I... Uh, don't think we can ignore what just happened to Lee. He lost a lot of blood down there. If you find yourself getting winded, or worse, you gotta let us know. And it wasn't my favorite hand anyway. Well, you haven't lost your spirit. Seriously, though. Don't treat me any different. I got one goal, you hear me? Yeah, we do. Now what? We get down and we find a little girl out there. Right, pal? Now, let's get our bearings. Hospital must have run out of doctors. What's up over here? Bell Tower. That's what's up. Huh, yeah. That could help. Hey. I think you're Clem's favorite, you know that? Really? Yeah, she's a big fan. You get away with shit I never would. We're getting her back, Lee. You know that, right? Yeah. When we get this fucker, we'll get out of sight and leave you with him. You get me? I get you. How's the leg? It's doing a lot better. Thanks for going into Crawford for me. Even if it wasn't entirely for me. Clementine, too. She's tough as hell. Isn't she? Yeah. Don't worry more than you should about her, okay? I'll see if we can make it out to that bell tower. Okay. Be careful, though. I don't want you going any sooner than you have to. Thanks. That's the church across the street from the mansion. River Street should be just beyond that. We need to head back that way. We'll stop off at the mansion, like you said, and make sure we didn't overlook anything. Yeah. I might have a way to clear us a path. I can make it to that bell tower. I can draw the walkers down to that side of the hospital. There'll be thousands of them. That'll thin out the streets between here, the mansion, and River Street. Even if it's just for a few minutes. Anything over here? Honestly, my vision isn't great. I think it's allergies or all that shit those walkers are kicking up. Allergies. Shit. People used to get those. I know, right? You never see anybody in an end-of-the-world story with pay fever. It's not the time to get wistful. I know. It's this deal with Clem. It's everything. It's put this rage inside me like I can't even say. I used to get allergies too and just... Fuck. Who was that guy? Someone with priorities? Got any good ideas for getting through that, uh, herd? I'm working on it. Are you gonna be able to hang in there? I have to. I was thinking you and Omid wouldn't come with me. We can't stop looking out for each other. You two have been solid since day one. What's this, day three? Four? Well, I appreciate it. The mansion's that way. Yeah. If we can use that bell tower to bring them to that side of the hospital, 
It won't be an easy trip back toward River Street, but it wouldn't be impossible. I'm with you. Just have to get over there. Whoa, you need some help with that? I got it. Damn it. Buy us some time. Draw as many as we can this way. Get down off the roof on the opposite side and bust our asses getting back to the mansion. You think you should be the one to go? My leg's feeling better. Let me do it. If we have to decide who takes a risk like this, it should be the guy who's got the least to lose. What's the worst that could happen? I get bitten again? So we're agreed then. Why the hell are we letting the one-armed guy do all the high-risk maneuvers? Because the one-armed guy insists. Now shut up about it. That thing looks a little rickety. Maybe keep that shit to yourself next time? Yep. Are you okay? Yeah, I'm fine. I was wishing I had my other hand. No shit! Try to find another way out of there? Way. Tons of them! Jesus! Now get back here! I think I have to jump! There's no way back! You can make it! It ain't that far! You got this! Got this, motherfucker. <sighs> Good goddamn leap, pal. Let's get the hell off this roof! Come on! Just come the fuck on! Well, we're not coming back here after we find Clem. Who? Fuck! How could this happen? This was Vernon. You think so? Definitely. Hey guys, Lee's right. It was Vernon and that support group. No fucking way! The invalids? Their actions uh, contradict your characterization, but yeah, the invalids. He's right. They're not invalids. They're just people. People who've been dealing with shitty situations even longer than we have. No wonder they got the jump on us. I don't give a fuck if their Make-A-Wish was a fucking boat ride! 
When I find them, I'm gonna rip their throats out! We'll never find them. We would have done the same. Says the guy who wouldn't take a box of food from an abandoned car. Things have changed. He says he feels bad about leaving Clementine behind. But the boat was an opportunity they couldn't pass up. Vernon probably planned this out the second he laid eyes on that boat. They fucked us! Omid, can you go over the fence and let us into the backyard? We shouldn't be out in the open. Yeah. This is not happening. Everything is so fucked. Clementine is still out there. So we get Clementine and then what? We get the fuck out of cities. I'm done with cities. We go into the countryside and make a go of it. I don't want to go back out there again. Then don't. Go your own way. You're every man for himself until you and your boyfriend actually need something. You wouldn't have had a boat to lose without us. So shove it, okay? Krista's right. Boat was a pipe dream. We still go after Clem, and then we get out of Savannah and rethink our entire plan. Rethink? How about we just think for once? That's what I'm saying we do. Calm down, Kenny. We can do this in the yard. What do you think, Lee? What do we do now, without a boat? Well, I know you two are just gonna look out for number one. And number two. You know, yourselves. It's not like that, man. Bullshit, it's not. Don't engage him, Omid. There's other shit at play, all right? What, you got the boat hidden somewhere? Shut up, dude. Watch your mouth. Find a small town. Maybe one that hasn't been ripped up too bad. At some point, people are gonna have to start rebuilding. And you guys and Clem should be part of that. I don't know. Lee's right, Krista. We've been so goddamn scared of strangers for so long, but at one point, we gotta take our chances, right? This is bullshit. You might not even be around, so... With all due respect, Lee, his opinion doesn't carry a lot of weight. Hey, it's still his little girl out there. She's number one. That's the end of that, okay? But what about... Oh shit! Here they come! In the house! 